Hey guys, welcome back. This is Twisted Princess, and we are here with Life is Strange. I am not quite sure what we're getting into here. Life is Strange is a story-based game that features player choice. The consequences of all your in-game actions and decisions will impact the past, present, and future. Choose wisely. Well, resume the game. Oh, that's loud. was so surreal. Famously called film, Little Pieces of Time. But he could be talking about photography, as he likely was. Okay, I'm in class. Everything's cool. I am okay. From light to shadow. From color to chiaroscuro. Now, can you give me an example of a photographer who perfectly captured the human condition in black and white? I didn't fall asleep, and that sure didn't feel like a dream. Bueller. Weird. Diane Arbus. <gasps> there you go, Victoria. Why Arbus? Oh. Because of her images of hopeless faces. You I feel can't. like totally haunted by the eyes of those sad mothers and children. She saw they humanity as tortured, no right? Farther. And frankly, it's bullshit. Oh, wait. Shh, shh, shh. There we go. Look at this it. crap. How can I show this to Mr. Jefferson? I can hear the class laughing at me now. Okay yourself seriously though i could frame any one of you in a dark corner and capture you in a moment of desperation and any one of you could do that to me isn't that too easy? Shh. i believe max has taken what you kids call a selfie a dumb word for a wonderful photographic tradition and max has a gift well, we of course as you picture. all know the photo portrait has been popular since the early 1800s your generation was not the first to use images for selfie expression. <clears throat> Sorry, I couldn't resist. The point remains that the portraiture has always been a vital aspect of art and photography for as long as it's been around. Now, Max, since you've captured our interest and clearly want to join the conversation, can you please tell us the name of the process that gave birth to the first self-portraits? <laughs> You're asking me? L let me think. Um... You either know this or not, Max. Is there anybody here who knows their stuff? Louis Daguerre was a French painter who created daguerreotypes. A process that gave portraits a sharp reflective style like a mirror. Now you're totally stuck in the retro zone. Sad face. Very good, Victoria. The Daguerrean process brought out fine detail in people's faces. 
making them extremely popular from the 1800s onward. The first American daguerreotype... I can't believe I still have this pencil case. I should upgrade to the 21st century. But I like it old school. If anybody else looked at this, what would they think? Um... Oh, good God. My favorite month, the best weather of the year. Should find a real Halloween party to crash so you can experience some social mingling. At least I'm trying to climb out of my cocoon. Okay. Her 18th birthday. Or even online. Up. Oh. And guys, don't forget the deadline to submit a photo in the Everyday Heroes contest. I'll fly out with the winner to San Francisco, where you'll be feted by the art world. It's great exposure, Yay. and it can kickstart a career in photography. So Stella and Alyssa, get it together. Taylor, don't hide. I'm still waiting for your entry, too. And yes, Max, I see you pretending not to see me. Victoria, Victoria doesn't waste a second kissing ass. Even if you're submitting your photo for the competition, everybody in class is turning in a photo, so you see the dilemma? I know Every time I look at Victoria, I feel like she's talking smack about me. I'm sure you know what it's like to be consumed uh, look by at the TV. Work. I see you, Max Caulfield. Don't even think about leaving here until we talk about your entry. I'd never I let one of photography's believe. future stars avoid handing in her picture. Do I have to? I just don't think it's that big a deal. Max, you're a better photographer than a liar. Now, I, I know it's a drag to hear some old dude lecture you, but life won't wait for you to play catch up. You're young, the world is yours, blah, 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 right? But you do have a gift. You have the fever to take images, to frame the world only the way you envision it. Now, all you need is the courage to share your gift with others. And that's what separates the artist from the amateur. Okay, so... Now let's go to the door and see if we can get out of here. You didn't tell me how cute I looked yet. I was about to. I feel like you have to pass you always Welcome to the real world. Just cute. Hot. Then I might send you a special picture in China. Because Max wants everybody to see how happy she is. I'm not paying She plays it so sharp. <laughs> I need a serious time out in the bathroom. Splash water on my face and make sure I don't look like a total loser. I hate that class. It's so fucking boring. No, I told you. She's so fucking shy. There we go. Earplugs. Mute it all out. Oh no, it's headphones. That's even better. I love that picture of mom and dad. Hello, Jack. Kiss, kiss. Andy, you look totally fabulous as usual. Imagine a world without you. American girls, I'd like to be part of the world around you. Driving a car. I hate bully jock straps like Logan. Andy's a Vortex Club member. It looks like she's been gone for months. All I know is you're supposed to take a picture or something. I wish I had. Can we go now? I need to go splash some water on my face and freshen up first. Oh, we have to find the bathroom first. Well, 
let it sit. I don't think it's that way. Here we go. Thank you. Empty. Good. Nobody can see my meltdown. Except for me. <sighs> okay. Use that. Since it gives us the option. Just relax. Stop torturing yourself. You have a gift. Fuck it. Uh oh. When a door closes, a window opens. Or something like that. Okay, girl, you don't get a photo op like this every day. Then we'll take a photo. Is that still long enough for you to get a picture? Uh. It's cool, Nathan. <laughs> Don't stress. You're okay, bro. Just count to three. Don't be scared. You own this school. If I wanted, I could blow it up. You're the boss. So what do you want? I hope you check the perimeter, as my step-ass would say. Now, let's talk business. I got nothing for you. Wrong. You got hella cash. That's my family, not me. Oh, boo-hoo, poor little rich kid. Oh, I know wow. you've been pumping drugs and shit to kids around here. I bet your respectable family would help me out if I went to them. Man, I can see the headlines now. Leave them out of this bitch! I can tell everybody Nathan Prescott is a punk ass who begs like a little girl and talks to himself! You don't know who the fuck I am or who you're messing around with! Where'd you get that? What are you doing? Come on, put that thing down! Don't ever tell me what to do! I'm so sick of people trying to control me! You uh -oh. are going to get in hella more trouble for this than drugs! Nobody would ever even miss your punk ass, would they? Get that gun away from me, psycho! No! Uh-oh. Whoa. What the fuck? How, how <laughs> yeah, can that be? Yeah, that'd be fucking trippy. I was in the bathroom. He shot that poor girl. I held up my hand. And then I was back here. Yes, he likely was. These pieces of time can frame us in I already world. heard this lecture. From light to shadow. From color to Now Kate shadow. is being hassled again. And if Victoria's phone rings, this is real. Now, <gasps> Shit! Can you give me an example of a Damn, photographer? I cannot believe who this. Captured the human condition in black and white. Okay, if I'm crazy, Anybody? I might as well go all the way. Bueller? Diane Can I actually Arvin. reverse time? There you go, Victoria. Why Arvin? Oh. Wait. I did now, it. Yay! I actually did it. A photographer who perfectly captured the human time machine. And white. Anybody? Bueller? Max, Diane don't freak Arvin. out. Not yet. There you go, Victoria. Still Why the aren't... same stupid picture. Keep it together, Max. You feel like if anybody else looked at this, what would they think? Next. This does not exist. Um. Okay. Totally haunted by the eyes of those sad mothers and children. When I took my... Damn it, she everything is the same. Tortured, right? And frankly, it's bullshit. Shh, 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 shh. Keep that to yourself. Okay. Seriously, though, I could frame any one of you in a dark corner. And cap... Shh, shh, shh. 
I believe Max has taken what you kids call a selfie. A dumb word for a wonderful photographic tradition. And Max has a gift. I know I'm not dreaming course, this. You all know, the it's real. Has been I can tell. The early 1800s. Your generation so I can go back in time. For selfie expression. What if that girl so isn't dead yet? I couldn't resist. The point Can I save that her? The portraiture has always been a vital aspect of art and photography for I need to go to the bathroom quickly and check it out. Now, Max, since you've captured our interest and clearly want to join the conversation, can you please tell us the name of the process that gave birth no. to the first self portraits? Oh, well, yeah, we portraits. can. We have, we have, we know that answer. I'm sorry, but I really have to use the bathroom. Nice try, Max. But you're not going to get away that easy. We can talk more after class. Is there anybody oh, here shit. who knows their stuff? Jefferson wants to keep me after class. And I need time to save that girl. A process that gave portraits a sharp reflective style like a mirror. Now you're totally stuck in the retro zone. Sad face. Yeah. Very good, Victoria. Sad. What if I rewind again and give him the right answer? Find detail in people's faces. Okay. We'll do that. That's a good idea. Now, Max, since you've captured our interest and clearly want to join the... All right. The Daguerrean process, invented by a French painter named Louis Daguerre around 1830. Somebody has been reading as well as posing. Nice work, Max. <sighs> the Daguerrean process made portraiture hugely popular. Mainly because it gave the subjects okay. clear defined features. Well, you can learn more when you actually finish reading the assigned chapters. Max is so far away. Wow, my old. And hey guys, don't forget the deadline to submit a photo in the Everyday Sorry, Heroes contest. I'll fly out with the winner to San Francisco where you'll be feted by the art world. It's great exposure and it can kickstart a career in photography. So, Stella and Alyssa, get it together. Taylor, don't hide. I'm still waiting for your entry, too. And yes, Max, I see you pretending not to see me. Max, you are not crazy. You are not dreaming. It's time to be an everyday hero. Yes, Victoria, you still have to do your homework. Whoa. Yes, Victoria, you still have to do your homework this week. Huh. Even if you're this might make a cool shot. Everybody in class is turning in a photo, so you see the dilemma? I know, Mr. Jefferson. I just worked so hard on this shot, and I'm sure you know what it's like to be consumed by your work. I just yeah, really think I'm Everyday sure. Heroes is an important cultural event, and I want to represent Black Lives I see you, Max Caulfield. Don't even think about leaving here until we talk about your entry. I'd never let one of photography's future stars... I'm not avoiding. I'm not avoiding, just... Biding time? Waiting for the elusive right moment? Exactly. Max? Don't wait too long. John Lennon once said that life is what happens while you're busy making other plans. I want to see what happens next. Damn it. Go on now. Don't let me stop you. Thank you. Okay. But I don't want to undo it. It's time to be an everyday hero. Excuse me, Mr. Jefferson, can I talk to you for a moment? Yes, excuse you. No, Victoria, excuse us. I'd never let one of photography's... Okay. I'm on top of it. I think John Lennon once said that life is what happens while you're busy making other plans. Max, you're on fire today. All the right answers, good. Yep. Make sure All you right finish working on it by today. <laughs> I have faith in you. Um, thank you. There we go. Let's go open the door. Back to the bathroom. I hope I have enough time to get to the bathroom. Please, please. I can't tell anybody. They'll think I'm crazy. Yep, let's just run down here. Daniel. You know I don't teach. This is an I hate that science class Wait. with those nerds. I can't What's that got to do with anything? <laughs> Because if you send me a picture, I won't do more. And you. Okay, Max, retrace every step. Yep. 
first thing. I washed my face. I shredded my photo. Then the butterfly flew in. And I took a photo. Leave them out of this bitch! I can tell everybody Nathan Prescott is a punk ass who begs like a little girl and talks to himself! You don't know who the fuck I am now, or who doing? you're messing around with! Where did you get that? What are you doing? Don't Come on, put that thing down! Tell me what to do! Wowzer, it's happening. Sick. I need a hammer to break it open! You are going to get in hella more trouble for this than drugs! Looks Nobody like Samuel forgot to take the cleaning cart out of here. Get that gun away from me, psycho! Holy shit, I can't let this happen. All right. If I can reverse time right. again, I can help her. Don't ever tell me what to do. I'm so sick of people trying to control me. You are uh, going to get in uh, hella more I'm trouble for this than drugs. Take. Nobody would take. ever even miss your punk ass, would they? Get that gun away from me, psycho! Oh. I'm so sick! Don't... Ever tell me what to I'm not going back far enough, okay. Don't ever tell me what to do. Spin I'm around. so sick of people trying to control me! Move you are going to get in hella more trouble for this than drugs. Nobody would ever even miss I your can't punk get ass, it would they? Spin right. Get that gun away from me, psycho! Oh, the controls will be oh. Ooh! I'm going to get in hell No. All the way back. Don't Move. ever tell me what to do. I'm so sick of people trying Wait, to control me. Never mind. What? You are going to get in hella more trouble for this than drugs. I thought I had to grab it. No way. Don't ever touch me again, freak. Woo! Finally figured it out. Another shitty day. That did not happen. This cannot be real. I just saw a girl get shot and then saved her. What the fuck is going on? Do not freak out. Hey, do you hear that fire alarm? That means you should be outside. I had to use the bathroom. Girls always use that excuse. Uh, excuse for what? For whatever you're up to. Your face is covered in guilt. The alarm tripped me out. Then trip on out of here, Missy. Or are you hiding something? Huh? Thank you, Mr. Madsen. The situation is under control. There's no emergency here. Leave Miss Caulfield alone and please turn off that alarm since that's your job. <laughs> Asshole. All right, guys, we're going to go ahead and cut this one here, and we will pick up right back here as soon as we get back. Don't forget to sub, follow, like, Twitch, Twitter, Facebook, all of that fun stuff, and have a great whatever it is, wherever you are. Catch you next time.